All right, we're already thinking about kids going back to school and yeah, now the menus are beginning to change. Bistro 82 in downtown Royal Oak recently rolled out their fall menu and it's full of fresh seasonal flavors and inspired uh, the inspiration and creations uh, were rolled out uh, by the executive chef and his team, which includes uh, Joe Van Wagner, who is the chef de cuisine of Bistro 82. Uh, welcome and thank you so much for joining us thank here this so morning. Much. So how do you decide, you know, when you're beginning to freshen up the menu, how do you guys decide what you're going to put on the menu? So seasonality in Michigan is absolutely a week to week thing mm -hmm. for us. So, you know, we talk to the local farmers, we talk to the different purveyors and we see what what they're doing what's looking good that week and then we build the menu around it see this is how you know you're precise you see that it's like a large pair of tweezers you always have to have the right tools for the job that's right Keenan. so now what are you making here for us today this is a vegan inspired zucchini bread mm -hmm. that we made with the inspiration of the bounty of goods that we have at the end of summer here in michigan so you have the zucchini bread under it. What are you dressing it with on top here? Right now I'm dressing it with some pickled shallots and some smoked cipollini onions. Um, so really this dish focuses on two main ingredients, onions and zucchini, because mm -hmm. we have a plethora of these going into the Indian summer. Um, and like I said, this dish was made with the intention of satisfying the vegan guests on a much greater level than than what we normally see in restaurants. Right. Normally we feel like vegan guests are overlooked. Right, so. they're sort of trying to find out what can I eat and so instead exactly. of having something that they have to sort of scout for, you guys are offering them something that is bolder and certainly, you know, this looks like it's gonna have a number of complex flavors there. So tell us a little bit about some of the flavors that you're balancing. Absolutely, so every time we create a dish at Bistro, we want to create highs and lows texturally and flavor component wise. Um, so what I'm doing here is I'm adding a little bit of puffed rice, okay. puffed grain to this dish to add a textural component. Okay. Anne Marie, come on over. Yeah. You may not be able to speak. I don't know if they're going to put your mic on. I've asked them not All to, I but they might put it eat. on anyway. But here. Mm. So uh, you're, what are some of the other items that you guys uh, have on your menu? Go ahead, step in there. Uh, th some of the other Thank menu, you. some of the other items that you guys have. Okay. The other items here we have featured are the pheasant. Um, this was a dish that allowed us to explore different cooking methods mm -hmm. and kind of get away so from traditional chicken right. dish, um, but still offer white meat. Um, what do we have down here? Over here, we have octopus oh, that I love has octopus. been braised and grilled That's with his olives and almonds. Wonderful. All right. Well, Amazing. Bistro 82 is in Royal Oak, and uh, you guys have rolled out this new menu. Absolutely. And where can people find you if they don't? Oh, there it is, right there, bistro82.com. <laughs> right and downtown. of course, it's uh, at 401 South Lafayette Street. Joe Van Wagner, uh, Pleasure. thank you so much for thank joining you us. So much. Uh, when we come back, we'll take a look at the forecast. We're talking mm. about fall like food. I have fall like temperatures for you when we come back. I'll also break down your storm chances today. You're watching 7 Action News this morning on TV20 Detroit.